Today, I'll teach you about electricity. So, first of all, let us try to understand what is happening in an electric circuit. I'll first tell you a story of two cities. So, we have city A here. City A has a lot of good land and a lot of farmers, so it produces rice for export. City B is like Singapore. We don't have much land, we don't have many farmers, and so we need to import rice. So, City B imports rice. So, it is very natural for City A to sell its rice to City B. Now, how does the rice from City A go to City B? There have to be roads connecting the two cities, as shown in this picture. Now, the roads are not enough. The rice from City A cannot fly to City B by itself. So you need vehicles to transport them. Example, the trucks I drew here. So when these trucks go from City A to City B, they will be filled with rice. And once these trucks arrive at City B, they will unload their rice in City B, and then they will return to City A. But this time, of course, these trucks, as you can see, they are empty, not carrying any rice. So this is a simple story of two cities. Now, what does this have to do with an electric circuit? So, as you can see, I have electric circuit here. I have an electric cell. It's connected to a light bulb by wires. Now, what is happening in electric circuit is similar to what is happening in the story of City A and B. Now, the electric cell is like City A. The electric cell supplies electrical energy. Just like City A supplies rice. The light bulb consumes electrical energy. Just like CTB, it consumes rice. The wires in the electric circuit is just like are just like the roads in the story. The electrons carry electrical energy. They are just like the trucks in the story which carry rice. And the rice in the story is of course the electrical energy in the electric circuit. So, if we look at the diagram for the story again, we see that we have City A producing rice, City B consuming rice, the roads linking City A to City B, and the trucks carrying the rice from City A to City B, and then the trucks returning from City B to City A. What happens in electric circuit is very similar to this. You have the electric cell supplying electrical energy just like CTA supply rice. You have the light bulb consuming electrical energy, just like CTB consumes rice. And just like the roads linking CTA to CTB, we have the wires linking the electric cell to the light bulb. And these wires, they carry electrons, which they themselves carry electrical energy from, from the electric cell to the light bulb 
just like the trucks carrying rice from city A to city B. So in summary, what an electric circuit is doing is to link, connect a source of electrical energy to a circuit component which uses electrical energy. That is what a circuit is doing, connecting a source of energy to something that uses energy.